What are you looking at? I'm looking at you, Rhea. Is there a problem? You tell me. What do you want? I want you to show me how to harness brutality in the ring. You? <laughs> you don't understand what you're talking about. I had some pretty wild matches before coming to WWE. I know more about it than you think. Brutality is about more than just being powerful and fierce in the ring. It's making people fear you and what you're doing next. It's being unexpected. It's bringing the chaos without restraint. That. I want to do that. I want you to show me how to harness brutality. What, do I have a sign that says free lessons or something? I can't help you. You can help yourself though, provided you're not too weak. I'm certainly not too weak. Then cause some chaos and do it somewhere unexpected. Hmm, maybe a different brand then. Sure, show up unannounced and decimate some opponents just for the hell of it. That's a pretty solid calling card, but I'm not going to hold your hand. Who are you going to actually take out? Feeling like Chelsea Green and Zelina Vega could use some chaos. Just don't play nice when you get there. Kind of defeats the purpose. why the captain decided to insert herself into this match, but the WWE Universe is excited to see her. It certainly makes the match more interesting. Well, this move is somewhat unexpected from the cap. We'll have to see if it's a one-time thing or a sign of a new attitude. Being carried around with ease. Right across the larynx. Stomping. Ouch. Oh, boy, come on. Not the chair. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Running clothesline. Oh, and an inadvertent shot hits the referee. She's going under the ring now. Once she gets going with that kendo stick, this match could be over real fast. <laughs> Impressive reversal there. Oh, straight forearm. Somersault reverse DDT! Look at that insult to injury with that one. Well, that is a sign that definitely gets the point across. And that was an effective one. Play it possum! Whoa, play it possum! Gets the shoulder up instantly. Able to get that shoulder up so quickly. What a statement. Oh. Big form. Here we go. Exploder suplex. Chelsea on the receiving end. Ooh, takedown. Bam, what a slap. Uh-uh. And I can assure you that wasn't part of Zelina's usual cold and calculating strategy. Oh, Zelina Vega has a chunk left on. And we know she can use it well. Ooh, man. Fishing for something beneath the ring. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the play. Oh, ouch. That's gonna hurt. Good defense. A counter answered by another counter. She braces for impact. Oh, spike face first. And shoulders are down. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. She's still in this one. Fails to connect on the springboard. Close line to the back of the neck. Big shot taken. That one's going to leave a wreck. And each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taking a toll. No telling what she'll find under the ring here. And she's wasting no time kicking things up by bringing this chair into play. Oh, God. 
She's taking things to ringside. Haymaker connects. Uh-oh. Oh, no. From behind. Oh, boy. Climbs back inside. attacks one after the other, making it difficult to regain any composure. Hammerlock suplex! Watch out! Driving their opponent down with a bulldog. looking for here. Oh, boy. Kendo stick in hand. Nefarious look in her eyes. Oh, cracking the kendo stick across the head. She might be in some trouble now. It's expected, Cole. In a triple threat match, the target on your back is twice the size. Just relentless. Ooh, what a forearm club. Oh, had it scouted and met with a back elbow. Series of reversals. Chelsea Green laying down the gauntlet for their opponent. And now she's getting back into the ring. Power bomb! Oh, with authority! Big hammer connects. Chelsea Green in her clutches. Good night. What a stunner. This spells trouble for Chelsea. What is she thinking? What is she thinking? Oh, my! And a menacing look from Zelina Vega. Drop toe hole. Oh, this, this may end it right here, right oh. now! Kane Destroyer! That's gotta be it! Two! Wrist clutch applied. Look at this! Oh, record slam! Eat the feet! Shoulders down! And a victory! What a win she picks up here tonight! Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Standing tall above the two other hungry competitors who were in this match. I think it was fairly apparent early on that she was going to do anything she had to do in order to get the win in this triple threat. And boy, did that resolve pay off. Okay, so you can at least pretend to have what it takes. Although maybe it was a one-off. It wasn't a one-off. I'm not pretending. Why are you here? I like watching people flounder. It's fun. And I'm not convinced. Who hurt you anyway? What? No, seriously. Who hurt you? Chaos is one thing, but my brutality has a message. Every time I step into the ring, I'm making a statement to the world that there are no limits to what I'll do to get what I want. 
So next time you step in the ring, consider what you're fighting for. What makes you angry enough to go all the way? Everyone else be damned. And who you're going after to make your point. Who I'm going after? For instance, do you want to challenge the toughest of the tough or pick someone who may be very talented but is also more innocent? That's what I'm talking about. Targeted brutality. I'm making a statement. No excuses for those who try to follow the rules. I'm demanding a match with Roxanne Perez. Demanding. I like it. And work on your gear. If you're going to be associated with me, you'd better look the part. So, we're associated now? Shut up. The captain has been a force to be reckoned with as of late. I like it, Cole. She's mean, she's focused, and she doesn't care who's in her way. Well, she should care. She's across the ring from one of the baddest competitors in the WWE. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. Off the barricade! Uh-oh, draped across the barricade. I do not like the looks of this. Boom! I don't know who's feeling this more, her or the crowd. Getting back into the ring. She's surely revving up, but she better put the rubber on the road already. Yikes. Vice-like grip on the throat, up and sell choke slam. Full Nelson, dragon suplex. Ah, oh, foot just stomping down. Enough already. Roxanne just can't seem to stop this offense. This is where Roxanne will be tested. No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, DDT off the apron. Uh oh. Oh, God. A huge miss. There's bad timing, and then there's whatever you want to call that. Now to get down to Pone and look at them go over and over and over again. And a slap for the exclamation point. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. What a shot. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. And now gets tossed into the ring. And guys, she's dangerously close to a count-out loss. Barely made it back in time. I didn't think they were going to make it. Snap suplex. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Sometimes you just got to show off and show out. Up across the shoulders. What's next? TKO. Oh, man. Well scattered reversal there. Caught with a DDT. Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. Standing Spanish flyer, are you kidding me? Incredible. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. She had it scouted. What's Perez fixing to do? Russian leg sweep. And into the count. She shows that she's far from finished. And able to beat Perez to the punch. Second row, she comes up empty. Turns it around, sole the foot meets the stump. Standing shooting star press. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. The close of this match is just ahead. Yeah, things are not looking up for her right now. 
striking combination. Lethal. Placed into the corner. Great reaction from Perez. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. Time to go for a ride. Exploder suplex. Hits to the core like that will render you useless. On the shoulders and a slam. Nasty right hand. Answers with an enziguri. Crashing to the floor. Rock springboard. Shooting star. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Boom, just turn that around. She's getting fired up, ready to show her opponent what she's got. What a double axe handle. Perez telling her opponent to bring it. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Oh. shot in. Cutter. Here we go. The exploder. Boom. That kick will stop you in your tracks. She was clearly waiting for that. for that. Super Springboard! Shooting star to the floor! That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear. Absolute reckless abandon. She throws her back in. Roxanne Perez. Man, she is great. Close line. Look out. Followed by an overhead kick. Things not going how she'd like. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. And Perez saw that coming. Implanted by the DDT. Roxanne putting in the work. Roxanne knows, do the work, and results will follow. Shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. She still fights out in one. Shows that this is still anybody's match at this point. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Whoa! Suicide dive! Soaring out of the ring, looking to do as much damage as possible. Perez caught by surprise. She lets it one more time. Face plant. Roxanne's got to dig deep now. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. And Roxanne being aligned into position. Kick to the gut. What now? Going for the pin on Roxanne. Wait. What's she doing? Looks like Cap decided she still had a point to make in this match. To the corner now. This is brutal. I guess that was the three count she really wanted. I know we've been seeing a different side of her lately, but I can't believe she would go this far. And she's not done yet. Seems like she's looking for a weapon. But she already had this match won. A steel chair? What's gotten into her? Hey, look out! <laughs> A show of force for sure, but not like this. Is she having second thoughts, maybe? Looks like it. Nope, never mind.
Well, this match is over, but not the way we expected. Roxanne may be the winner, but she's not the one walking out of here having made a statement. But why? I have a feeling we'll be hearing more from her soon, Saxton. I hope so, because I don't get it.